A couple of years ago, you said the following about Ahmadinejad when you were on the campaign trail. Ahmadinejad, the madman, is in competition with mullahs and ayatollahs who think he's overstepped his bounds. Biden called him, quote, that wacko guy, the crazy president, and said he would only be in office for a little more than a year before being taken out because he threatened Shia interests. He's proved to be more durable than that, hasn't he? Yes. Why? Well, I think because uh, it appears as though uh, um, the supreme leader has uh, decided the alternatives uh, aren't as uh, aren't as useful. Um, but again, this is uh, I'm getting a little ahead of myself here. We have to see what the results were. We have to have an analysis of it, and that'll be being done by not right. just us, by every country in the world, and uh, and and we can make a better judgment then. You don't want to recognize him as the president of Iran at this stage? Well, uh, I, I'm, I'm not, look, that's, that's what they're announcing. We have to accept that for the time being, and, but there's an awful lot of question about uh, how this election was run, and we'll see. I mean, we're just waiting to see. We don't have enough, we don't have enough facts to, know, to make a firm judgment. Even